for the most part, many people in Bangladesh actually view the tiger as, as, as very revered. So they have a lot of pride um, in that habitat and that they have, uh, they, that, that habitat houses the Bengal tiger. Um, unfortunately, I think that um, there has been poaching and it becomes prevalent, particularly if, if you've got people that are in extreme need. Um, but they are probably being backed by outside sources that are, that are getting them the equipment needed to be able to even make it into the forest. So the, the, the Bangladesh Forestry Department has got forestry stations with guards throughout the forest. Um, so they are very diligent about um, trying to prevent these forest crimes. And they have actually implemented some new uh, techniques using um, motion-activated cameras to be able to take pictures and that way they can capture who is coming into the forest, uh, particularly like who's coming by it in a tidal channel in a boat. They can identify these individuals and then prosecute them. So technology has actually helped them quite a bit in recent years. Uh, and I know that they maintain um, diligence to try to keep uh, the forest crimes down as much as possible.